today they're going to be creating self-portraits of themselves as superheroes. So we're going to work on what superpowers they have. So whether that be strength or kindness, um, everyone's going to be kind of different. And then, of course, we're going to decorate them with a ton of glitter and sparkles and all that fun stuff. <laughs> I like glitter, so I decided, and I'm a girl, so I decided I was glitter girl. Her superpower is to have glitter bombs, and if someone touches it and they're sick, like, like anything, it can heal, heal them. So, Brody, what's your superhero's power there? Um... Well, he's not that different from me because he can, he has really bendy body parts, especially his fingers. So would you say that's super flexible? Yeah. Yeah? Do you feel like you're super flexible? Yeah, well, mostly in my fingers. <laughs> Everything has glitter on it that she has. Leaves glitter wherever she goes. But, um, yeah, when she was in the hospital during transplant, her medical treatment, wearing the costumes, having... Her glitter, it helps her think of happier times and keeping a positive attitude through everything. During Brody's treatment for um, kidney disease and having to go through dialysis and getting a kidney transplant, he had to be very brave and strong, but had to also be flexible because his life had changed quite a bit in having to um, go to lots of doctor's appointments and he isn't able to play any contact sports, so he has to um, show his other strengths and other things that he can do. So yeah, he's got to be flexible in realizing that he's got to not live life necessarily the way other kids live their lives. So what are you thinking about while you're drawing? Are you thinking about his eyes? Are you thinking about... I'm kind of thinking about where like, the mask um, kind of like ends and where it shows his eyes. They're drawing themselves in the superhero kind of state and it just kind of gives them strength. I just enjoy seeing like the impact it has. It's just a way to relax and just have some fun and be a kid. And then, yeah, it's like a good form of art therapy.